Hello and welcome. This is Jit Dulakya and you are watching its tomorrow news. Let's talk about tropical depression nympha. Slow moving tropical depression nympha maintains strength. Tropical depression nympha maintained its strength on Tuesday evening, September 17, while moving slowly over the Philippine Sea. In a briefing past 11 pm on Tuesday, the Philippine Atmospheric, Geophysical and Astronomical Services Administration said Nympha is 685 km east of Basco Batons. It is slowly moving west-northwest. Nympha still has maximum winds of 55 km per hour and gust line of up to 70 km per hour. But it could become a tropical storm while inside the Philippine area of responsibility. It appears Nympha will not make landfall in the country and there are no areas under tropical cyclone wind signals. But the tropical cyclone depressions through uh, extension is bringing rain along with the southwest monsoon or hanging hackbat. Pegasus advised to the public to watch out for possible flash floods and landslides. Travel is also risky in the northern and eastern seaboards of North Luzon with rough to very rough sea conditions. Most of the other seaboards of the country will remain moderate to rough, said Pegasa. Based on Nympha's latest forecast track, it will leave par on Saturday, 21st September. Meanwhile, the low pressure area that forecasters have been monitoring is already in the vicinity of Mayantec, Tarlac and could cross central Luzon. Pegasa said it may eventually dissipate within Nympha's circulation. Nympha is the Philippines' 14th tropical cyclone for 2019 and the 4th in September. The country gets an average of 20 tropical cyclones annually, but since 2019 is an El Nino year, only 14 to 18 tropical cyclones are expected. Tropical depression, but the southwest monsoon is affecting Luzon and West Visayas on Wednesday, September 18. Tropical depression Nympha remains almost stationary over the northern part of the Philippine Sea, while the southwest monsoon or hanging hackbat is bringing rain. Nympha is not expected to make landfall in the country and there are no areas under tropical cyclone wind signals. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Jit Dolakya. For more weather updates like this, please subscribe to our channel.